Italian Air Force Captain Samantha Cristoforetti is a native of Milan, but she grew up in the Italian Alps in a small tourist town of Mali where her parents ran a hotel. She doesn't remember a time that she didn't love adventure or want to explore space. I was very fortunate to enjoy a childhood in which you, you can roam around as a child, you know, unsupervised, you don't have adults with you all the time. And maybe that's why I got that taste for adventure that I think is very much part of uh, that desire I always had to, to go to space. Her adventurous nature persisted as she grew up. She spent her junior year of high school abroad in St. Paul, Minnesota, because it was in the country that had the most exciting space program. Then she earned a degree in mechanical engineering from the University of Munich, which included research in aerodynamics done in Toulouse and in solid rocket propellants in Moscow. Next, she joined Italy's Air Force Academy, just as the country first allowed voluntary military service by women, while also completing a bachelor's degree in aeronautical sciences at the University of Naples. Then it was flight training at the NATO school at Shepard Air Force Base in Texas, followed by fighter training. And when one of the infrequent astronaut selections by the European Space Agency came up, she applied for the program even though she was doing her operational conversion to the AMX ground attack fighter. She was selected for ESA's astronaut corps in 2009 and is now eager to contribute to making a reality out of her dream. Imagine humanity in 500 years. Do you imagine humanity being still earthbound? Like we still are not able to go anywhere else? It, it, to me, is being part of the, you know, the first step towards that future that is so obviously part of, of what's coming for, for humanity.